हेलो एवरी वन हे इज द नेक्स्ट टॉपिक मैग्नेटिक फील्ड ड्यू टू अ करेंट कैरिंग सोलोनाइड वट इज अ सोलोनाइड अ सोलोनाइड इज अ कॉइल ऑफ अ लार्ज नंबर ऑफ सर्कुलर टर्न्स ऑफ इंसुलेटेड कॉपर वायर रैप्ड ओवर अ इंसुलेटेड सिलेंडर विच आर रैप्ड वेरी क्लोजली टू ईच अदर दिस इज नोन एज द सोलोनाइड द अरेंजमेंट इज नोन एज सोलोनाइड इंसुलेटेड मटेरियल मीन्स यू कैन टेक अ कार्ड बोर्ड और अ प्लास्टिक बोर्ड यू कैन यूज इन द फॉर्म ऑफ ए सिलेंडर टू फॉर्म द सोलोनाइड नाउ वेन करेंट इज पास थ्रू अ सोलोनाइड वट इज द पैटर्न ऑफ द मैग्नेटिक फील्ड लाइन्स फॉर्म इन इट इन दिस फिगर यू कैन इजीली ऑब्जर्व और इन्फर डैट द मैग्नेटिक फील्ड लाइन्स इन दिस केस इज वेरी सिमिलर टू द magnetic field lines in a bar magnet therefore the solenoid behaves like a bar magnet when an electric current pass through a solenoid magnetic field is set up around solenoid similar as a bar magnet this can be clear from these two figures which are shown below one is the solenoid carrying current another is the bar magnet now the characteristics or the properties of the magnetic field lines formed in a solenoid first one end of the solenoid acts as a north pole and the other as the south pole that is it is similar to the bar magnet which is having the north pole and the south pole the magnetic field inside the solenoid is in the form of the straight and parallel lines inside the solenoid the magnetic field inside the solenoid the magnetic field lines is in the form of the parallel and straight line uh, the parallel and the straight lines show the uniform magnetic field hence the magnetic field inside the solenoid is constant or uniform magnetic field inside a long solenoid decreases towards the ends of the solenoid which can be shown in the form of the separating or spreading out of the field lines as we move towards the end of the solenoid from this figure you can easily understood the characteristics of the magnetic field lines that in at the center or inside the solenoid the field is in the form of straight line that is uniform and as we move towards the ends the field lines are becoming curved that is the variation in the magnetic field intensity now the direction of the magnetic field line that or the if the solenoid behaves as a bar magnet that is it is having the north pole and the south pole then we have to find the polarity of the solenoid when current is passed through it that is we have to find which end will act as the north pole and which end will act as the south pole for this we will use the clock phase rule what is clock phase rule when the current flows in clockwise direction in the face of a circular wire then that phase behaves like a south pole that is if you see from one end of the solenoid and if you see the current is flowing in the clockwise direction then that end will behaves like a south pole and the other end will be acts as the north pole as when you see from that end you will see that the current is flowing in the anti clockwise direction anti clockwise direction means north pole this you can easily understood understood from this two figures where s is written in the form of a clockwise direction and north pole for the end that is drawn in the form of the anti clockwise direction from this you can easily understood the clock phase rule now the use of the solenoid use of the solenoid is in the form of the electromagnet electromagnets are used in electric generators electric motors electric bell and what is an electromagnet electromagnet is a temporary magnet which is magnetized when current is passed through it a strong magnetic field produced inside the solenoid can be used to magnetize a piece of magnetic material like soft iron when it is placed inside the solenoid suppose you take a piece of the soft iron and insert it inside the core of the solenoid and pass current through it it will be magnetized this is known as the electro
factors affecting the magnetic field intensity due to the solenoid first the factor is current greater the amount of the current flowing through the solenoid greater will be the strength of the magnetic field intensity that is b is directly proportional to i second number of turns of the coil larger the number of turns of coil greater is the magnetic field intensity that is more closely spaced the number of the turns of the coil greater will be the magnetic field strength third nature of the core material as earlier told that when a soft iron piece is placed inside the core of the solenoid its magnetic field intensity increases that is it is can be increased to a very large amount then on reversing the direction of current the polarity of solenoid also gets reversed that is the north pole turns south pole and south pole turns north pole